Thank you. All new at six, new hope for one Buffalo neighborhood coming now more than five decades after construction on the Kensington Expressway. Some advocates say that the 33 has created disparity for decades. But now, as 7 Eye with this News senior reporter Eileen Buckley shows us tonight, local leaders believe that President Biden's bold $2 trillion infrastructure plan could be a big help here. The inbound 33 can take you from the 198 to downtown Buffalo in a little over three minutes. The Kensington Expressway was built in the early 1960s. And the east side of Buffalo has been cut in half by this superhighway because of bad decisions that were made decades ago. When they built the 33 Expressway, it tore through a beautiful Humble Parkway and caused racial inequity throughout this city neighborhood. But President Biden's massive $2 trillion infrastructure plan is designed to help cities like Buffalo that made transportation mistakes. With this massive infusement of federal highway funding, we'll be able to right the wrongs of the past. State Senator Tim Kennedy says for years, he and others, like the Restore Our Community Coalition, have been pushing for restoring Humboldt Parkway. Would you actually try to get rid of that? We've actually advanced through the Department of Transportation is a reconnecting of the community through a decking program that allows for green space and public access, as well as um, pedestrian and bicycle access. Kennedy is chair of the state Senate's Transportation Committee. The 33 is a state highway under the State Department of Transportation. Kennedy says the federal highway bill would pay for 80% of the price tag for massive projects like the 33. State and local communities would then need to shell out 20%. How does the state DOT work with you on that? What the uh, Biden administration advancing this infrastructure program does is allows us to fast track the federal 80% match. What we need to do on the state level is make sure that we are there as well as the local community. My hope is that uh, Washington comes through for us. And when they do, uh, we'll be ready uh, to provide uh, improvements in every corner of the city. Buffalo's Public Works and Streets Commissioner Michael Finn and Buffalo Mayor Brown say the federal funding will be used on many projects across the city to improve all neighborhoods. We're going to invest right in the city proper. We're going to invest in the things uh, that uh, people uh, feel need to be improved. Right now, it's unclear how much federal funding will come to Buffalo. But Mayor Brown says he was told it could be significant. In Buffalo, Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News.